Hello, and welcome back to Cardano Coin, where we bring you the most recent and intriguing ADA news. We're giving away 1,000 ADA to those who are watching. All you have to do is upvote, subscribe, comment Cardano is king, and watch the video to the end to be eligible. The winners will be picked next month and publicized on the community page of the channel. Cryptocurrencies and blockchain technology are here to stay, despite their infamous reputation as instruments for financial speculation. But what about a certain cryptocurrency's long-term survivability is peculiar? Can this lead to applications in the actual world? This is one of Cardano's outstanding qualities, which helps to explain why it has so many advantages in the cryptocurrency space. It's beginning to make sense now. Although there were cryptocurrencies before Bitcoin, they did not become well known until a few years after its launch in 2009. Bitcoin was eventually created after several failed attempts, but it took more than 20 years to develop into the well-known cryptocurrency it is today. Bitcoin, however, it was not the first cryptocurrency, is regarded as the oldest cryptocurrency still in existence as it was initially published in a white paper in 2008. Some brave and wealthy investors have emerged from the unpredictably volatile cryptocurrency market but it has also resulted in significant financial losses for them. Every investor is vouching for the industry because it is prone to ambiguous rules, flagrant fraud, and the potential to grow in other sectors. Despite the 2022 market turmoil, given the ongoing drop in the value of digital assets, investors might be looking to invest some money. Cardano ADA is down a startling 73. Investors are still preparing to add the native coin to their portfolios this year alone. Well is purchasing the dip, known as an Ethereum Slayer. Charles Hoskinson invented Cardinal, a cutting-edge cryptocurrency. The Ethereum killer aims to address the scalability problem that existed in Ethereum prior to the merging update. Investors appear to appreciate the attention because the yield in just five years of operation is quite favorable. With a $12 billion market valuation, it is now the seventh largest cryptocurrency. Not bad at all, right? Because of how slowly and steadily it has developed compared to other cryptocurrencies, the Cardano network prides itself on being unique. Before being implemented, its modifications are thoroughly investigated, peer-evaluated, and your assumptions are correct. Although it takes more time, this procedure can help blockchains expand by ensuring that errors are kept to a minimum, despite the fact that it has acquired the nickname the Tories Chain. Cardinal is now working on Bashow, the fourth phase of its plan, which full phase of its plan, which full phase of its plan which focuses on scaling solutions. Charles Hoskinson has already made hints about the fifth and final phase volunteer, which will add governance features to the network to fully self-stain the ecosystem. It is amazing to watch as cryptocurrencies like Cardano find brilliant ways to achieve widespread adoption over time and in truly amazing ways. Fardano's efforts have been successful. Given that there are currently 20,000 cryptocurrencies, it seems to reason that creating a string of crypto brands would be one method to differentiate oneself from the competition and create a reliable ecosystem of developers, users, and investors. Numerous cryptocurrency ventures are competing for market supremacy as the whole WAX sector grows. Projects with additional use cases in this instance seem to be better received by the various audiences. Results of a 2022 brand intimacy study by the Brand Regulatory Agency and BUM examined how hundreds of well-known businesses built emotional connections with consumers and followers throughout the world in relation to cryptocurrencies. The findings were extremely unexpected. 
As usual, Bitcoin and Ethereum were expected to take the top spots, but something had changed this time. With a quotient score of 52.6, Cardano emerged as the top cryptocurrency brand in the world, surpassing other well-known brands like the automaker Ford and the food processing company Nestle. Cardinal landed in the 26th position worldwide. On the other hand, Polka dot came in first overall with a rank of 111, while Bitcoin came in second among digital asset brands and occupied the 30th spot. Ethereum, the fourth cryptocurrency brand, was ranked at 120 at the same time. From this vantage point, the top cryptocurrency is fairly obvious. The Impom brand intimacy study focuses on the most emotionally powerful companies, and the ranking makes use of cutting-edge methods like artificial intelligence to determine how consumers relate to the brands they adore and use frequently. The research evaluates intensity and stages using a quotient score between 0 and 100 to determine the degree of intimacy. The emotional connection to a brand is more intense the higher the score. The asset has allegedly outperformed Bitcoin, a widely used and traded cryptocurrency, as a result of numerous campaigns. It's important to remember that Cardona's hypothesis was supported by the network's cheaper investment costs, ability to reduce risk, and branding that positions it as a platform aimed at supporting all changemakers. Cardano is a blockchain platform for changemakers, according to the report. Those with the means and technologies needed to make it possible for both the few and the many to contribute to positive global change, as well as innovators and visionaries. This may help to explain how Cardano builds stronger relationships and more emotional connections with its users. The discoveries were in line with the Cardano network's efforts to improve blockchain technology and supplant rival platforms like Ethereum. For instance, when the research was done, the network anticipated the hard fork of the vessel. Cardinal was also the most advanced cryptocurrency project on GitHub in 2021. Despite the fact that Bitcoin lags behind Cardano, the Impom research stated yes. It has become increasingly integrated into users' everyday life. Standing out is a significant aspect of customers' daily lives. The industry of cryptocurrencies, which was added to the list for the first time, was ranked 8th out of 19 industries. This is a sign of customers' dissatisfaction with conventional financial services a loss of confidence in and rising contempt for these institutions may lead disgruntled users to look for alternatives. According to the report's conclusion, traditional financial services have underperformed cryptocurrencies, and this is a factor that will have an impact on both industries' futures. The research claims that because of all the blockchain advancements occurring, including the option to stay on Cardano ADA and take part in new decentralized finance platforms, people were certain that the future of Cardano was exciting. Additionally, it was noted that nobody seemed irritated by Cardano's sluggish progress. In fact, one of the remarks mentioned how well Cardano was progressing. This is an interesting development and Cardona will have lots of competition from other layer 1 blockchains like Ethereum and Solana. Which blockchain ultimately succeeds in the long run may be directly related to customer loyalty. Simply put, brand loyalty might seem trivial, but in the realm of cryptocurrencies, it could provide a significant competitive edge. One such example is Solana which is competing to become the crypto industry's Apple, yet came in third in the brand report after Cardano and Bitcoin. In the future, 
Cardano might not have the same instant brand awareness as Bitcoin, but its incredibly robust and intriguing Layer 2 solution, known as Hydra, might significantly increase the throughput of the Cardinal blockchain. With 1,000 Hydra heads operating concurrently, each of which is capable of processing 1,000 transactions per second, Cardano could execute an astounding 1 million transactions per second. Right now, early 2023 is the projected release date. The potential for increased speed and scalability makes Cardano a possible disruptor in the field of decentralized finance, posing a threat to both Ethereum and Solana's hegemony. Another significant motivator for Cardano is the anticipated release of the algorithmic stablecoin, GID. Near future, this stable coin can be used to supplement specific DeFi protocols with liquidity and go up against other well-known stable coins like Tether and US coin. Now, when the Cardano creators tweeted that Dogecoin, now when the Cardano creators tweeted that Dogecasm and Shock, renowned for his frankness, initially. Charles Hoskinson had proposed that if Doge agreed to be an ADA sidechain, he would handle the integration for no cost. When there was hardly any response from Doge Coins and Hoskinson, he added that he would also incorporate smart contracts for the Meme coin. He then tweeted again, this time conducting a poll. The Cardano community could pitch Twitter the sidechain offer since it is completely connected with the social network. In fact, the ADA founder was wise enough to include a Twitter clause in his offer. Hoskinson asked whether he should pitch Twitter a post-quantum ultra, fast, and identity. Enable Dodge sidechain of Cardano that was specially designed for social networks and use the hashtag quantum dodge. Elon had to sign off on the Twitter acquisition. This may not even be an example of intelligence, but rather desperation. Charles Hoskinson may have more options in the cryptocurrency market thanks to the Cardano Dogecoin alliance. After deployment slowed down for several weeks following the Vassal upgrade, ADI appears to have restored them, according to Santiment. It's possible that this action was influenced by the recent Hydra solution, despite the advancements. Whether Dodge would accept the suggestion so core Donald Hoskinson is still out in the air. For the network to continue operating, we must come up with other plans. Cardona is still a long-term purchase and hold investment, though, when perhaps tens of thousands of get rich. Quick cryptos are thrown out in the trash bin of history. It will still be around. Of course. What do you think about this? Comment below with your thoughts and let us know. In the following video, we'll see you. Check out our other films to see how Cardinal is fulfilling his desire to become the Ethereum killer in the meantime. Be careful to always click the subscribe and notification buttons.